with a computer anywhere in the world to control his Christmas lights. He's had already 800 light changes the first night the site went live, and the numbers continue to rise. That man, Tom, joins me from Akron, Ohio, to show us how it works. Tom, this, this is so cool. Where'd you get the idea? Well, I had this idea about maybe four years ago. Um, I, I, you drive past these wonderful neighborhoods where they have music and animated <laughs> Christmas lights and all that kind of stuff. And I thought, well, I'd like to try it. But when I looked into the cost, it was like, you know, thousands of dollars to buy special light hardware and special software. So I went around on the internet. I, I found a web page from a, a fellow from Australia. His name's uh, Keith Wesley. And so this is four years ago and he hacks Christmas lights. So if you go to a store and buy these Christmas lights at Animate, you know, he says you take, you buy the lights, you cut off the control box, and you wire them into something called an Arduino, which is like a little microcontroller computer, and you oh can make God. them do whatever you want. So, I, I, so this is awesome. For, You're using hacking for good instead of evil. Now, honey, <laughs> did you take into account what your power bill was going to be? <laughs> well, these are all LEDs. Oh, perfect. and uh, so the power is pretty low. But the problem is, is now that it's popular. Um, my system can hardly keep up with everyone clicking. I think someone clicks <laughs> every single minute. <laughs> you think there's and, um, somebody sitting at home in their basement just having the time of their life, staying online, controlling your lights, and not letting the rest of the world have a go? <laughs> oh, it's, it's wonderful because in the past three years, you know, people would actually stop by the road and look at the lights, but that was before they got on the Internet. Yeah. So this past year, my buddy said, you know, from Australia, he said, toss everything you've known, you know, out the window, and let's try something new. So what okay. the lights will do now is, is when you go to this website and you click on one of the links, um, it goes into my house, your request, it goes into something called a Raspberry Pi, which is like a tiny computer, and then it goes into the lights and then makes like probably, it's only like 1,500 lights, but they're on four trees in the house and they all paint awesome. the house with color, like rainbows oh, or confetti. And, yeah, oh, and so I, I built this whole system inside of a place called a makerspace. Um, have yeah. you heard of something like that? I have, yes, um, I have, it, yeah. At, at the University of Akron Wayne College, where I work, we have a, a free open to the public makerspace. Awesome. So, so these kind of crazy. We, we, we just wanted to have a quick conversation with you about it because we just think it's a great way to, to bring innovation mm -hmm. and technology and the Christmas spirit together. I, I love it. I think it's, a, it's a, a really great innovation that you've done. And, you know, here's one for the makers out there. Keep on doing it. Uh, and hopefully the bedroom, you know, reading lamp isn't flickering every time somebody gets control of your thing as well. Tom Hammond, a very Merry Christmas to you, my dear. Thank you Thank for you. joining us. Keep up the great and creative work. Thank you very much. Pleasure is ours. All right. That's